Here lies Hiono Kachida. Died a virgin. Don't grieve. Anything you lose comes around in another form. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to Demons Never Lie. Uh, uh last time we got in trouble, and now we need to go see a girl in the park. But it's locked, and we don't have anything. So, I don't know what we're going to do here. Can we... Oh, we can walk around now. There's a, a pub bar, but it's Chinesey, I guess. I don't quite understand. We can go in. Let's go in. Check it out. I think we're going to get kicked out. Uh, a hammer. Hey, don't touch that. We need it for work. Haven't you seen the construction near the park? We are just taking a break. Sure. This place is bumping. That looks like my ma. This looks like my ma. Is that my ma? That's Jimmy. Are you Nadine, the famous singer? Oh, yes. Do you like my songs? I love them. I'm a big fan of yours. Your voice is so beautiful. Are you going to sing tonight? Oh, he's got angel wings. Or crystals. Yes, after the DJ finishes his session. This place is so cool. We try to keep it deep. Archangel. Lucky you. My father broke my stereo and now I can't listen to music at home. Is that so? Surely you have a turntable at home? Not everyone has a turntable at home, dude. You should check this out. It's a limited edition. Object vinyl. Wow, thank you so much. Stay house. I've just finished my session. Now it's Nadine turn. Now it's now it's Nadine turn. Alright. Probably make a cut there. Because an actual song off of from a like a singer came on and I looked it up and like this singer is I mean pretty popular. She was she did like a song like two she did that song two years ago that played in there and it's got like 42,000 views so I assume I can't play it on YouTube on my video even if I gave her like credit in the description um, and I just stood there listening to the music because it was really good music and I didn't realize that while everyone was distracted that I was going to steal the hammer and open the park so I just sat there for like a good five minutes making faces to myself but now we're in the park with the hammer so it was <laughs> i was trying to figure out like if i would have got a copyright strike if i just let that play and sure enough i probably would have also uh i forgot what her name was the little angel girl peter finally you're here my god you're soaked get under my umbrella Oh, she's so nice. Okay. Although the umbrella is a little small for the two of us. Then get closer to me. Mm -hmm. Are you blushing? No. No, of course not. You're blushing. I prefer to stay without umbrella. It's not raining so much. Whatever. Come on. I'm going to take you to the a part of the park that I'm sure you didn't even know existed. Very few people know how to get there. You're lucky to be with me. Uh, what's it about? What is this pe 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 place? You'll see. It's right here. Follow me. Uh. Well, this is quite interesting. Here, Peter. This is a part of the park. There's just a demon's gate. There's just a gate to hell in a park in the middle of town, wherever we are. I didn't even, I didn't know there was a cemetery in the park. It was closed to the public years ago because it was believed to be cursed. 
Here is buried former police lieutenant Oliver. Remember the case of the Ojo, the serial killer? It was in the news. Yes, my father was working on that case. He was on Oliver's team. Then you know that Ojo kidnapped the lieutenant's daughter, Aurora, and killed her right in front of his eyes. Oliver lived an impeccable life. Even when he had the opportunity to kill his daughter's murderer, he didn't do it. Wow. When he died of a terrible illness, his soul went to the light. There, he was reunited with his daughter, Aurora. I believe the little angel's name is Alba? I believe, because I remember making fun of her for Albuquerque at some point. Although her name wasn't Aurora, but Alba. Yep, alright. When an angel's d appointed, they are assigned a new name. A name for the light. She knows a hell of a lot about all of this. Oliver was in front of the God of Light and was named an angel as well. That was when something unexpected happened. Oliver's Okaso, is he? Keep going. I'm on the edge of my seat, please. Then what happened? There he cursed the God of Light for not having done anything for the humans and for creating the world we live in. And for letting what happened to his daughter happen. He explained that he had only been pretending to be good for all those years in order to reach the light and destroy its god and his kingdom. The god of light, angry, banished the angel to darkness, turning him into a fallen angel, a demon. But not just a common demon. He became one of the most fearsome demons of the darkness. Since then, he torments humans and collects souls for the god of darkness. Day by day, he decreases the number of souls in the light in order to destroy its kingdom, and ensure that the god of light suffers the loss and feels the loneliness like he felt when he lost his daughter. It is said that when his crypt shines like this, it's possible to contact the demon. I've been watching this place for a long time. It does whenever there is a full moon, starting at midnight. But I can't decipher the puzzle to get in. You can communicate with a biko, a biko, a minor demon. He'll be able to read the inscriptions and then I'll be able to contact the demon. Why? Why do you want to do that? You want to contact the demon? Why? There's one detail I didn't tell you, Oliver. Nope. There's one detail I didn't tell you. Oliver was my father. Your father? Then Alba is your sister. That's why you can see her. That's right. She is the one who told me this story. You want to contact the demon because you want to talk with your father again. My father doesn't exist anymore. I know that he doesn't remember anything about his human life. So, is Okaso Oliver and then Alba... So Alba's his daughter, but do they... So they just compete now to get whose soul, I guess. I want to contact him to bring back my sister. He can do it. Because my sister is a member of the light, I'm sure that he would help me since the kingdom of light would lose another soul. And that's what he wants. Oh, man. Listen. You're crazy. I'm not gonna... But this is crazy, Amelia. You have to get over your sister's death. You sound like the professor. I'm completely alone. Don't you understand? Alba deserves to have a happy childhood. She was taken by this madman who is still around. I thought that at least you would understand. I understand, but it seems dangerous. Just trust me, okay? No, no, no. No, I don't want any part in this. Let's not waste any more time. Let's go. The crypt will only be active for a few hours. But if that's the game, then that's the game. Oh my god. So we're looking for inscriptions. Hi. Oh, there's something. Yeah, this is oddly not where you think a police lieutenant would be buried. Well, uh, through my experience. Uh, this is the place I was telling you about. I can't decipher the code. I've only been able to activate one of the stones, 
placing a rune that I found near the statue. But I don't know what to do next. There's an inscription over the angel statue. Let's see if Ketchup can read it. Come on, don't make me beg. I'm sorry I ignored you. Now tell me, what's it say there? It says squeak, squeak, squeaky, squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeakity, squeak. Like the... It's like the, uh... The, uh, squirrel in, uh... God, Emperor's New Groove. Yeah, it's been a while. I gotta watch that again. If you want to talk to the fallen angel, call him by his name. If you want to talk to the fallen angel, call him by his name. That's what I just said. Ah, oh, there, maybe there's an echo in here. <laughs> it's a closed off stone room. Of course, we have to write the name of the fallen angel, the demon. And the name of the demon? Would that be your father's name? That's what I thought too, but Oliver has six letters, and there are only five spaces. O, C. It's Okaso. Gotta be. Gotta be. First, we have to find the rest of the runes. I'm sure they can't be far from here. Once we have them, it'll be easy to figure out the name. I didn't see any runes on the way in, man. Unless they just spawned. I'm not, I'm not getting what you're putting down. I'm not contracting the sickness that you're spreading. I don't think anyone says that. Alright, now we gotta look for some runes, because this, this chick is all mushy bushy about her padre. Oh, there's one. Uh, do you want to save? Of course, I do. Alright. Well, there's one. One of the runes. Bam. Rune A. Oh, each is a letter? Possibly. It looks like something is shining inside the vault. There are some bars. I can't reach it. Doesn't work. Alright, so there's another one in there it looks like. Oh, we can't go any further? Oh, what's this? A metal lever. There we go. Let's pry this baby open. I was about to... Anyway, it looks like something is shining inside the vault. Can't reach it. Pry bar. Now I can. Another rune. C. Ocaso. Wait, can we read all of these? Here lies Hiono Kachida. Died a virgin. Who writes that on their grave? Like, that's so... Here lies Kate Klingman. Died a virgin. <laughs> like, I understand if he's like a priest or something, but like... Here lies Alfonso... Figueroa. No man is an island entire of itself. Any man's death diminishes me, because I am involved in mankind, and therefore never send to know for whom the bell tolls. It tolls for thee. Was he a Shakespeare fan? Isa Kabir, the great dream hero. Uh, here lies Kigudim V8. Hopes and dreams for his channel. Oh. Oh, I gotta look up. I gotta look this guy up now. I hope. Alright. Kigudum. It's like kingdom. K. Guidum. Guidum. V. 8 8. Oh. He's got 42 subscribers. Oh, he does- he's doing a Demons Never Lie, uh, run through. Oh, wow. Alright. Dreams for his channel. Aw, poor guy. Here lies Juan Pires. Pardon me for not rising. Did I already read this one? Here lies Jordito. Alright, well. I guess that's it. Kigudum V8, 8, V8, poor, poor guy, poor hopes and dreams, he's got more subscribers than me. Don't, don't waste your hopes and dreams, keep them alive. Alright, so I want to put, 
Let's see, this one's A, so this one will be C. Seems to fit. Uh, is that the noise for doing good? Because that's a horrible noise for doing good. It's like someone just distorted nails on a chalkboard. Alright, so it's definitely Ocaso. We need an S and an L. But where oh where will we find said SO? No, but really, if I can't leave this place, then... Maybe I can. Maybe I'm just dumb. Like, no, no, but really, can I leave? This is really weird. Do I leave through here? No, later, hold on. Well, we can walk back here, I guess. Doesn't do me any good. Do we have to... We have a pry bar. Can we pry open? Yes, we can. A coffin. I can't open it. The lid is very thick and it's nailed shut. Maybe if I use something. Well, here we go. This is what I signed up for, I guess. Opening graves. Popping the top off, just like a Pepsi. With this, I can open the lid easily. There's another one. There's a rune inside the coffin. Rune O. Yeah, wouldn't you know? Hey, sorry about that. Sorry, I just had to desecrate your father's grave. Now we're looking for an S. Alright, I'm gonna talk to her. Oh, wait. I can't. Hmm. Maybe it appeared. Wait, whoa. whoa, whoa. What's. Some ceramic pots. There's nothing inside. This isn't Zelda. You can't just go around smashing and clay pots. I guess you can. There we go. There's a rune inside one of the pots. Apparently this is Zelda. Never underestimated game. Never. Alright. Bam! Ocaso! Now, don't put the hammer there. Come on! Think you're with it with- think with your noodle. It's the vinyl That was a lot of yellow. You've done it, Peter. You're incredible. Thank you. I'm really good at demon stuff. The name of the demon's Ocaso. Ocaso? Why does that name sound familiar? What was that noise? What do you think it was? Behind you, a secret passageway. Da -da -da -da. We did it, Peter. Thanks to you. Let's go quickly. That sacred book to invoke the demon must be down there. Do you really want to do this? Of course. I've been waiting a long time for this. You can't crack now. Well, we could. We could go back to that uh, Chinese pub bar. I don't know if it's Chinese. I should just say Asian. Just to, uh, cover all the bases. Um. Going on. An inverted star. This place gives me the chills. Yeah. Usually I'm pretty comfortable when I see inverted stars, inscriptions, and... Going on. What is this? A pillar for sacrifices. The bottom fills with, with the blood of the sacrificed and it's used for rituals. You're not sacrificing me, are you? Don't worry. We won't need it to invoke the demon. Oh, thank God. Thank God. All we need is the sacred book. It must be around here somewhere. I'll look around. Okay. It looks like a throne. Who does it belong to? Who do you think? 
There's something on the wall. It looks like a button. Boop. I wonder what the button's for. Eh, well, she's gone. What happened? Interesting. Did we do a good? Oh, she's over here now. Very good, Peter. You, you've activated the secret altar. But, the sacred book, it's not here. Someone beat us to it. But who? Who else knows about this? I have no idea, but without the book, we can't do anything. Damn it, it's too late. The entrance will close at any moment. We have to get out as soon as possible. I'll have to try to figure out another way to contact the demon. The crypt will open again and on the next full moon. We'll meet here again, okay? I don't think it's a good idea, but I do want to see her again. Oh, okay. Listen, kids, if you're ever in love, don't join a demonic cult, okay? They did it in Brickleberry, and it didn't work out. Hello, I'm home. Well, it wasn't like a demonic cult. It was just like a one of the regular cults where they go to space. What a great welcome. All right. What's going on, old man? Oh. Shh. Uh, you okay, Ma? Ma, are you okay? What happened? Peter, it's you. He hit you again. Don't worry, I'm fine. This can't go on like this. And I won't let it. Get a suitcase and pack your things. We're leaving this house. But where will we go? I... I know someone who can help us. Who? His name is John and he's a good man. He's a friend of yours. No, I'm John, okay? And Peter. I'm everyone. Well, he's something more than that. But we'll talk about that later. How was class? You came home very late. I was talking to a girl. Well, I met a very nice girl. Her name's Amelia, and we have a lot in common. We stayed talking a little after class, and then went out late. Seriously? You don't know how happy that makes me. Aw, oh, thanks, Ma. I knew that these classes would be good for you. Um, Mom, are you okay? Don't worry, I'm okay. Don't worry. I've been worse. I only need to rest. Things are going to get better now. You'll see. I know, Mom. Now rest. Oh, it's so sad. I'm going to absolutely decimate Mark, okay? Days later. No one lays a finger on my madre. It's me! Well, past me. This is going to be your new room. What do you think? Wow. We're going to make a lot of changes to the house, so you can- I've already read this. You can go wherever, uh, I've already read all of this. But we got the old music back. Wow, this bed is so big for me only. The truth is that this house is amazing. It's strange, but this place looks familiar, which doesn't make any sense. Deja vu like I've been in this place before Higher on the street Tonight is full moon Tonight is full moon I will see Amelia again in the crypt Yeah, ketchup No But what do you say? I'm not crazy about her I've just met her Although she's an amazing person She's able to see you too I don't have to hide who I really am And she is very pretty Smoking. What? No way. I didn't even notice that. Hehe, <laughs> we're talking about her butt. I wish I could get that book she cares so much about. I'm sure it would make her very happy. What do you mean the book is here? In this house? It's in the basement. Really? Can you feel it? Come on, tell me where it is. Come on, spill the ketchup. Hehe. <laughs> God, I'm laughing at my own jokes. Okay, I'll get you something to eat first. Although I don't know where the kitchen is in this house. I like this music. It's awesome. 
Hey, Ocaso. Oh, we can combine. Do we need to get something to eat? Good. Good. Very good. Anything that we can grab here? To the kitchen. Yep, we can't go into Maria's bedroom. As Maria is now... We can go in here. Interesting. Good thing I already know this house. Like the back of my... There's some meat and coke. My mother left dinner ready for me. Oh, how... It's already got bite out of it. Oh, how sweet. Anything else in this room? No, we can't interact with the washer and... I don't know who, it, like, has a dishwasher. Not nah, dishwasher. God. You know, anything I say that isn't related to the story, you should just not listen to. Just, just... I should just cut all of it out, because it's just so... Stupid, I mean... The... I was about to say it again. <laughs> The washer and dryer. I don't know who has a washer and dryer in their uh, kitchen. Look at what I got. It's a big piece of meat. Die. He just ran off. Wait for me. Oh, he's taking us right to it. To the basement. We actually are almost up on time. So I wonder. The office is closed for a police investigation. The book is around here? The door is locked. No. There's a book. Swal Eli. I, I don't know how to say that. Written by Laura Perez Macho. I'll take a look. And we'll take a look at this in the next episode. And I hope you all are excited as it... I hope you all are ex as excited for the next episode as I am. I'm really bad at words. I should just stick to reading. I really can't form my own sentences. God, I need to go back to school. Alright, so I appreciate it. I... See? What the hell? Alright, just end the episode. Just... Cut it. Stop.